So we've been participating in Alipay for the last 15 years. And this year we see Alipay 2023 as different in terms of the level of the attendance, as well as in terms of the content that is being discussed. We are more focused now on the energy transition journey as we go also together with our customers. Hello, my name is Tarek Makir. I'm the Regional Managing Director for Embassy Nas in Middle East. Hey, my name is uh, Prashant Srikumar. I am the Global Industry Manager for Oil and Gas. Uh, the One Story Exhibit, which is a collection of uh, all different technologies, product digitalization that we support. It's in terms of uh, what we primarily do is it's all about data, you know, making the data available for our operations maintenance so that they can take the right decisions in order to run the plan safely, efficiently. If I have to take, talk about a couple of products, what is in here, you know, our uh, laser-based moisture technology in order to measure moisture at uh, parts per million and uh, lower levels. Also, we have our tank gauging system uh, in show here. Uh, and what you see right at the back is all different flow portfolio from Coriolis to Vortex to ultrasonic technologies. We have received multiple inquiries as well as leads on our products, solutions, as well as services with a major focus on the decarbonization as a topic which fits into the sustainability focus of the UE. Topics like energy transition and uh, decarbonization forms uh, core of our business. We are focusing on these topics since last few years with a uh, focus on specific topics like hydrogen and carbon capture. On hydrogen, we have been working with uh, many projects globally, although this topic is very European today with a bit of focus in US, but we are starting to see new green hydrogen projects coming up in the region. Neom in Saudi Arabia, one of the biggest one. And if you look at uh, UAE, there are certain pilot projects. And the other huge topic in the industry is carbon capture. One of the first carbon capture projects in UAE taking uh, CO2 out of the steel plant and uh, moving it across to the uh, upstream facility for enhanced oil recovery. So there are a number of new carbon capture projects which is under various phases of development. From a portfolio standpoint, Anderson also offer the complete range of product service solution to support carbon capture projects. We are also fully aligning ourselves with the sustainability goals of the region. So we would like to grow aggressively, but of course we would like to do it sustainably. So we are measuring our carbon footprint on the region, as well as we try basically as the first measure in order to reduce the same. We are also going for the localization topic where we try also to involve the local population in our business. And of course, what my uh, colleague Prashant referred to in terms of the energy transition, the decarbonization topic, the hydrogen are all relevant. And we see that you know, our instruments will support our customers through their sustainability journey. Uh, focusing on the sustainability part of the business, we look at our EcoWard scores, which is quite high compared to many other partners which we see in the market today.